Good morning everyone, welcome to today's video. Today we're taking out the Miata to the Scala store to try on some seats that we're thinking about putting into the Miata. Now the thing with putting seats into a Miata is they're so small that there's only a certain amount of bucket seats you can fit in it. So I'm going to take these seats out, there's only four bolts in and the clips onto the seat and it's going to take them out and we'll pretty much go and try on the new seats and hopefully they fit. Now this is my new socket set from Scarless and it works amazing so we're going to use it to take out the bolts. I've decided that I think it'll be so much easier to take the seats out at the store so we might just go to the shop and do it there rather than me having to do it all here so let's get to the shop. Car hasn't been started in a bit so let's see how it starts up. Okay not bad actually. Alright now we're going to let it warm up we're going to make pit stops at the gas station because we're very low on fuel and then we'll head to the Scala store. Alright, we made to the gas station, now we're going to get some gas. I'm convinced that nothing beats driving your car on the motorway. Like, you just can't get enough of it. It's so much fun. Hearing the engine in this, it's so loud in these cars, like ridiculously loud. Nope. But I love it. It's hard to make phone calls, but we still love it. Okay, so we've just made to Scarless. Right outside, we've got this nice 33 Skyline. Next over here, we've got an R34 Skyline as well. Looking very clean. Very well done paint job, look at those wheels. Alright, so we're taking a measurement. Huh? Oh! <laughs> yeah! And we're gonna see if they fit the seats. So if they have a look online, it's a bit... It's gonna be a bit <laughs> short. The back is thinner though. That's true, it does come out. You're safe. I'm safe? You should be safe, yeah. Um, my main concern would be the, where your seat belt mount is. It's on the, um, uh, the trans tunnel. Trans tunnel, yep, no, that's all good. So it should, yeah, no, should be out of the way on the yeah. trans tunnel. I think you should be good. Right. I'll go get that seat out and we'll try it. Alright, so now we're going to get these seats out. Okay, so the seats are out. You always discover how messy your car is when you take your seats off. Like, I've got spare bolts here from something. It's a mess. And here's the got seat. It. We're gonna test it. Look how flipping messy it is. You always discover how messy your car is under the seats. All right, so now we're gonna test these. I'd like to do the reveal on it. Oh, yeah. I'll stop with you. How do you open it? Just <laughs> rip it open. So here's this purple glitter back seat. Look how nice that is. I got me to pick it up and put it in or? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's try to be gentle on me. Alright, this is gonna be oh. This is gonna be interesting. Close. I'll be cutting it very close. I don't know if they're gonna fit. Oh, maybe. What do you think? <laughs> yeah. That actually looks pretty good. Let me grab you some brackets and. Yeah, like, I think we should try with brackets. Yeah. But it actually looks so good. The color's like phenomenal. The color of the purple next to it? Yeah. Looks amazing. But if they do fit, we definitely have to do some cutting out of this door door pad because oh look at this! 
My fear is that these are going to get in the way, so I might have to like delete these. I don't know. We'll see. This is back. Huh? Oh. Uh, yeah. So yeah, just, um, can you see a lift? I might have to, lift. oh there, yeah, just go yeah, hold that. <laughs> Got the whole section just for the MX-5s. Make sure that's not gonna... Cool. Alright, let's try these. Let me grab the camera. Back. Easy. What's this for? Uh, that is Trent um, Drift Car. So he just competed in the MSC Challenge. Uh, fixing a few things and then he'll be back on track in the next couple of weeks. Hit a few, few walls during the drift. Alright, let's get these on. The good news is that the door shuts. Yeah? But I'll probably have to do some like cutting into the um, the you know the top pads? Yeah, it's too easy for you. Fun? The seat came out so easy. Uh, four bolts and a plug. <laughs> yeah, jeez. Talk have about you, safety, eh? Have safety. you had worse cars, like coming out harder? No, I've actually had easier. You've like, had easier? Yeah, my golf's incredibly unsafe oh, with getting out. Um, uh -huh. There we go. There's a bracket. I'm gonna put it into the car and hopefully see the fits with the seats. Fingers crossed. Alright, so I've got all the bolts off the seats, getting the sliding rails on. The main bracket is on the car, and B is just figuring out the lock mechanism for the sliders because we don't know how to use it. Did you figure it out? Yes, you did figure it out. So this is where your handle pressure is gonna be. And so we'll do one side and then you'll push it down. And then sorry, it's gone a bit more <laughs> oily. Look at all that. That's what you need though, good grease. Yeah, good grease, so you just push it down. Right, so we've got the seat on the brackets, we had to switch to the OMP brackets and it definitely took a while. <laughs> <laughs> took a hot second. But they're on the sliders, and now we need to chuck them in the car, and hopefully they fit. <laughs> right, so we've got the seat in doing some testing, it pretty much sits in line with the top which is a lot higher than the other seat but that's what bucket seats are like, they're a lot taller. Um, we put on the OMP obviously side brackets to get it in, everything's bolted in and yeah it sits in there nice. Now we took this off for the door to be able to close, I'm thinking if we cover this up with something and then get one of the, um, the rope handles and want to open and close the door, that should do the trick. That's only what we close but... <laughs> Looks amazing on the right, definitely. So we're gonna do some more tests just with the fitment and with being able to close the door and obviously getting the cert done for the seats. But for now, that's it for today's video and I hope you guys enjoyed this and I'll see you in the next one.